All that fructose still making me obese, man. Look at that. Because I can see the tricep shelf still. Cars make you fat, though. After fucking how many years is it now? 15 years in March. 15 years smashing in the sugars, the carbs, and vegan. Got a question about. Uh, According to Chronometer, I don't get enough calcium. I eat at least 2,300 calories a day, usually more. What kind of food can I eat that is low fat to get my calcium? And that is from Hannah. Cadillac, Cadillac, Cadillac. On Tumblr, ask Stuart on Tumblr. I've got over 20,000 questions. Might get back to you. But anyway, so this is, if, where's the banana? There's no bananas on the ground. Cliff Bar box. Even if you have Cliff Bars, they're gonna vary. If you had to go get a fucking scientist and you measure different boxes of cliff bars, they're gonna vary in calories, carbohydrate and fat content. But they just have to. There's no way every this is a packaged processed food made in a factory, pretty consistent, but it's from whole food ingredients. And when you get that from your oats from Maine or your oats from Florida or wherever you're getting your oats from, they're gonna vary based on the summertime light the seasons, the soil. Maybe there was one patch of oats where a few pigeons got eaten by peregrine falcons and the pigeon bones mineralized into the soil and the oats grew out of that. And that little batch of oats got made into a cliff bar and it's got extra calcium. So the, the lab people on the back, they do how many milligrams and micrograms and grams and that's an approximate. So when you punch into chronometer, I had 10 bananas today plus six lettuces and 15 dates and four, 10 potatoes and it gives you, it spits out a number. That number's not accurate. It's ballpark at best. It's gonna vary, because potatoes from the grower down the road might be different, that are going to be different from potatoes grown in the next state, or picked, or even on the same farm, the varying nutritional content will vary over the year, based on the sunlight, water, what animals died in the soil, if the farmer pisses on the ground and there's nutrients going back into, it all varies, man. So. When you put chronometers as a ballpark figure for calories, give you a, a, so you can eyeball stuff. So 30 bananas is about 600 grams of carbs. Bananas that big, big as your head. Bananas big as your head for about 20 grams of sugars, all right? So it's just basic ballpark. So we apologize if we're, people are like trying to like, you know, oh, oh two milligrams. No, 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 you can't microanalyze like that. It's not how it works, ever. So if anyone says, oh, you're a few milligrams, they're fucking noobs. They're dumb as fuck. And any nutritionist who punches you, oh, your diet's probably a little bit low on this. It's like, man, what? Don't you understand nutritional variances based on the seasons, the soil quality, the water, location, fertilizers? So many factors. There's a spider on my window again. Spiders all over here. So don't worry about it. Just eat enough calories. Smash the fucking calories in. Live aggressively. Live passionately. Get it fucking done. And if you're in doubt, just smash in some more fruits and fucking veggies. And fucking let's rock and roll!